about the urgent need. My name, my name is Blessing on your chair only, and I represent the good people of Otupo Ohimini. I am from Bain West State. Okay. Mr. Order, please. Order. Silence, please. Members, resume your seat. Silence, please. Go ahead. Go ahead. Mr. Speaker, I have a motion of urgent public importance. It is about the urgent need to tackle the assault and rape of minors by teachers at the FCT School of the Blind, Jabi. I therefore pray you to allow me to move the said motion. I equally pray the House to suspend the relevant rule to allow me to move this motion. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. That's it. <laughs> Recall that on the 16th of July 2019, Honorable Shina Abiola Pella moved a motion on the floor of this Honorable House on the need to tackle the scourge of rape and other sexual offenses against children in Nigeria. Note that, not, not that less than 24 hours after the resolution passed by the House on the rape of minors in this country, a worse form of rape and assault against blind girls was uncovered at the Federal Capital Territory School of the Blind, located at Jabi District of the FCT. Also note, Mr. Speaker, that the FCT administration officials who visited the school were shocked at the revelations made by the students and teachers over a blind teacher and one other visually impaired who regularly raped and assaulted girls at the school. Concerned that a teacher in the school, one Mr. Ibinaza Olatuji, has since become infamous for leading the blind students into hotel rooms where he drugged them to sleep before raping them. Aware that the school authority had confirmed six reported cases of rape by this Mr. Ibinezer. Also aware that the, another blind teacher, Mr. Ilo Chukuma, was found to be notorious in fiddling with the breast and other sensitive parts of the blind girl's body. Prayers. I urge the House to condemn in strong terms the rape of blind underage female students by their teachers at the FCT School of the Blind, Jabi. Urge the relevant department of the Nigerian police to carry out a thorough and proactive investigation into this matter. I also urge the House to take a firm position in support of capital punishment for perpetrators of rape and violence against underage girls. Urge the House to set up a committee to investigate the matter, make appropriate recommendations, and report back to the House. I so submit. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Oh, I watched on television, national television, of this very sad, unfortunate incident. And I want to beg that uh, we allow this motion go through, uh, pleading to our own conscience. We have children. Nobody will wish to have, wish to have his, any of his own in that kind of condition. Now, the question is that those in support of the motion say aye. Those against say nay. That's it.